my name is Hilary Webb and I am an actor for Quick as a Wink. I've done a couple of shows with them thus far and uh, I don't know, there's lots I could say. But that's, that's the gist of it. Um, I actually started working with Quick as a Wink with Annie and I got cast as Lily St. Regis and I was so taken by the professionalism and uh, the dedication that Quick as a Wink really puts into their shows. So I auditioned for Five Women and I got the role as Trish in Five Women, and uh, then I auditioned for Grease, and now I'm playing Marty Maraschino in Grease. So I hope to keep the Quick as a Wink theater going in my life anyway. It's hard to choose just one because I like to do a lot of variety of theater. Um, I played Meg Schneider in Leading Ladies for Center Stage, which was a comedy, and she was a very innocent uh, a young woman in the 1950s. Um, I really liked playing Maureen in Rent because, I mean, as a lesbian character who was very tough and in your face, that was such a contrast. And I really liked Trish and Five Women. I would say that was a, especially since she was on stage for the entire two hours and her character was so different than me as, a, as an individual, it was a lot of fun to play. I think the best thing about live theater as an actor is the fact that you have to be so on. There's absolutely nothing else you can think about. There's no other place you can be. You have to be so present in the moment because you don't get a second chance like you would in life in, in actual television. And so as an actor, it's, it's the ultimate challenge, just embodying that character the entire moment you're on stage. As, a, as an audience member, you're captivated by those performances. It's very rare that you can go anywhere and just see people so caught up in that moment because you know they're actors and you know that you, they're not those characters, but yet you suspend your disbelief for an entire two hours and become so involved in what's going on on stage. And I don't really think you can do that in any other medium. The television doesn't draw you in nearly as close uh, as live theater does, despite the binge watching I do on Netflix. Um, well, theater is, is one of my true passions, but I love to cook. I'm, uh, I'm uh, intending on opening a cafe next year, so love to cook. Um, I love to read when I get the time, love the outdoors, love being active, just essentially anything to keep me busy. I don't sit still very much, unfortunately. I like to craft. That's honestly a tough one because I kind of take opportunities as they come rather than having the one show in my life that I want to do. Grease is honestly on that list, so the fact that I'm a part of this show is, is phenomenal. But anything outside of Grease, I really can't choose one show. Maybe Sound of Music. I would love to play Liesl on Sound of Music. I'm getting too old for that soon, so if Quick as a Wink wants to do Sound of Music next year. Marty Maraschino has so much attitude in a very subtle form. She's not like Rizzo where she's in your face, but she she's mature, or she thinks she's mature, over and above everybody else around her, and she has her sights set on something higher. And I think that's a really unique character to play in a high school drama, because so many people are stuck in the present. I mean, that is a very teenage quality, but Marty is constantly shooting for something more, and I really appreciate that about her. The show itself. The fact that Quick as a Wink was putting it on, of course, is, is a huge draw because, as I said, the professionalism and the quality of the theater they do, but Grease is timeless. It's such a show that anybody can identify with because every single person is about to go into high school or has gone into high school. So it's just one of those shows that draws everybody in, no matter what age or, or lifestyle. I just hope you get an opportunity to come out and see it. Quick as a Wink will once again put on a phenomenal show, and uh, we look forward to putting it on for you.